I'm back in my kitchen with Andy and today you're going to teach me something much more wholesome. What is it? Alpler Magronin. And that's... It's like the Swiss version of mac and cheese, but much more delicious. Okay, one of my favourite dishes because in the winter it's really comforting and warming. And in the summer when you've been hiking and you find a restaurant on top of the mountain, they usually serve great Alpler Magronin. That's true. Have you made it before? I've made a really basic version with pre-cooked ingredients. Aha! This version is much easier. It all goes in one pot. It's super easy. Okay, then let's start. So first you want to chop three peeled potatoes into pretty small cubes. So now you want to grate 250 grams of cheese. Today I'm using half Gruyere, half Spriance. You can use any kind of hard cheese or a mix of them, Emmentaler, Appenzeller, whatever your heart desires. So now we've moved to the stove. You want to just cover your chopped potatoes with water. Put it over high heat, add a little salt, and let that cook for about five minutes. So now we add 300 grams of pasta. You can use Alpa macaroni or any kind of macaroni. And 750 milliliters of milk. And a stock cube or a little bit of stock powder if you have it. About a teaspoon. You're gonna bring that up to a boil and let it cook for about 10 minutes or until the pasta is cooked through. So now I'm gonna add the cheese. You wanna give it a good stir. If it's looking a little dry, just add a little more milk or water. This looks great. Then you can season it with a little salt, pepper, and nutmeg. Then you're done. And now let's eat. Looks great. Thanks. And my favorite bit is the applesauce that goes on the side. You don't have to make it yourself. You can just get pre-bought, pre-made applesauce, but it's really the best bit of it. It is. Goethe. Goethe. Perfect. 